Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's gonna be a quick video. My SRAM Red flat top chain uh, after about 5,000 miles and a year's worth of use started skipping on me. So I'm gonna go ahead and take today to swap out this chain for a SRAM Force chain. Uh, this is a little bit different in that it has solid pins instead of the hollow pins like the SRAM Red chain. Uh, so it makes a little bit of difference in the weight but I have actually read that the force chain runs a little bit faster as far as friction, so maybe that'll offset. Anyway, I'm gonna cut the chain down to length, prep this up for use, get it installed. Thanks for watching. So I am gonna go ahead and get a weight when I get these chains cut to length, but there is going to be a little bit of a difference, so it's not going to be a fair comparison. My force chain is going to be a couple of links shorter because my red chain was uh, set up for a 10 to 33 tooth rear cassette. I've since switched to a 10 to 28, so I'm going to drop an extra link or two off of this one. But we'll go ahead and see how that compares anyway. minutes later. Go ahead and pull this out and it feels so much better already. Looks shiny and clean. Go ahead and dry that off as much as possible. Get any of that nasty contaminated mineral spirits out of there. much more metallic already. All that uh, factory grease pretty much removed from there. Go ahead, douse it again. Another 30 minutes passed. Now what I'll do just give it a quick rinse down with some quick greaser and wipe it down, dry it off entirely, and then good to go. All right, let's go ahead and get a weight of the force chain. I'm gonna go ahead and include the quick link on that one. Two hundred and forty one grams. Get a weight for the Apollo Pin SRAM Red Chain. I'm going to leave the quick link off of this one since the force chain is a link shorter. So, two hundred and thirty four grams for the SRAM Red Chain. So, even though the force chain has one link less, pretty good uh, comparison there to see how much lighter the SRAM Red Chain actually is. Super clean chain. favorite lube right now, Muckoff C3 Ceramic Dry Lube. 
do most of my riding in the dry. So that's what I'll go with. If I do a wet ride, switch over to the uh, wet version. I did do chain waxing for just a short while and it's just such a headache to do. All right, so now that we have that finished, wait for it to dry, wipe off the excess, good to go for hopefully another 5,000 or more miles. So you have any questions on this, comments, uh, tell me how I did everything wrong, go ahead and drop them down there. Love getting involved in the comments. So thanks again, like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and enjoy your ride.